This is a uh, Eppendorf uh, 5804 centrifuge. Uh, it is a 115 volt unit. Came out of a government surplus facility. Uh, seems to work as it should. Uh, the, this doesn't stay up, but might need a shock. I don't know. Maybe it's not supposed to. I don't know. Um, the rotor is an A4-44. See right there. And then it's got two cups. Uh, pull, pull a cup. And it says Eppendorf. And it says 0801. And then you know these come out. And those say 5804 Eppendorf. It's like a four test tube deal. So, but that's not why I took the video. But I wanted to give an overview. So uh, the best I can tell with this, you hit time and you know you can go whatever infinite 99 minutes, whatever that is. We'll go to one, two. Then you hit speed and I can go, it goes up to 5,000. We're going to go to 1420. It does go up to 5,000. We took it up to 4860. It seemed like it was smooth and running okay. So why don't we go up to, I don't know, 2,000, 2,300. Um, nice and quiet. When it gets to 5,000, you can hear it a little bit, but it doesn't shake, it doesn't rattle. It's 660. I never noticed, but can you see? No, you really can't see anything. I mean, you can barely hear that it's running. It's turning at 1500 RPMs right now. I mean, it's not even shaking. You can hear it spinning, I don't know. It's got a little vibration, nothing, you know, I don't think anything out of the ordinary, but you can kind of tell it's got the time. So you can see it's counting down. We got 2300 RPMs. And as opposed to waiting for this thing to finish, I just hit stop. And it'll slow back down. Hit open. And take your stuff out. And that's the unit. Let me know if you have any questions, if you want me to run any tests. Uh, we have the, the uh, factory manual here. And uh, that's the unit. I take some pictures too. Uh, just plugs in a standard house current. And uh, I know this isn't specific to this, but you know, just a computer D plug. I don't know, but it probably won't be included, but if you need one, just let me know, and I will. I have lots of them. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Thank you.